Good morning, YouTube. I'm off the Wolf Creek Bike Path Recreational Trail. And this is Bernadette. I don't know how this name is pronounced, but this is her plaque. But There's a uh, little area back here called the Dollwoods. It's just a short little area. A little boardwalk. It's called the Dollwoods. Island of Woods in a Cropland Sea. So this unique woodlot located in Clay Township, which is just north of Brookville, in Clay Township, Montgomery County, is adjacent to the Wolf Creek Recreational Trail. It is a tiny remnant of the vast swamp forest that once covered northwest Montgomery County. The heavy soils and flat land made them land found here made for very slow drainage of rainwater. Trees thrived in wet conditions such as pen oak, swamp white oak, bur oak, American beech grew to immense size. Pools of standing water in the forest called vernal pools provided homes for many frogs, salamanders, waterfowl, and other wildlife and insects including mosquitoes. Springtime revealed a carpet of wildflowers and an abundance of native plants. I'm not going to read the rest of this, but you guys can see the rest of this right here. That So I'm going to walk back here for a few minutes. So this is Mr. Ralph Dahl's piece of property. He wanted to make sure it was preserved. It's only about eight acres, but I'm going to have a little look back here. So this was a swamp. This is a swamp forest. But of course, much of Ohio, this part of Ohio, was swamps as they converted, you know, swamps to agriculture back in the 1800s. And of course, much of Ohio during that time was very... Um, heavily founded by German settlers because German settlers, you know, they came in via the way of Cincinnati, worked their way all over, all worked their way all over this state and brought their farming skills with them. So this is a little remnant of, of what's a something that you don't see very often anymore. So it's great that Mr. Dahl, you know, wanted to conserve this and to keep some greedy fools from trying to make commercial real estate here because we're losing way too much of our woodlands to commercial real estate garbage and, and development that really just is not needed. I'm not sure if Mr. Dahl was still alive. That picture on that thing was back in 06, but... This is something that I didn't even know about. You know, this area called the Dull Woods. But it's nice that this was not converted to farmland, this little section of woods. Oh man, this is a huge tree right there. It's probably the granddaddy of them all for in this little piece of woods. I'm not sure what this is, but actually this no, that's this is a sugar maple canopy right down here. I don't know what this one is called. I'm not very good with my trees, but I know that's a sugar maple right down here. The smaller one. So this is a beautiful wooded wooded little area <clears throat> right here. definitely very nice right here yeah, this is only a small little plot right here so yeah this is a you know something that unfortunately we don't have a lot of you know left because they keep destroying our 
are good forests. So this was the Dahl Woods right here, named after Mr. Ralph Dahl, Vernal Pool. This is the location of it just northwest of Brookville. But anyway, YouTube, uh, that's going to be it for this one.